My name is Dr. Art Vazen, and I've been with CV Orthopedics for about 18 years now. My education began at MIT, where I got my degree in chemical engineering. Uh, then went to medical school at Robert Wood Johnson, where I got a master's as well as a PhD in psychology. Uh, following that, I went to Cleveland for five years, did my orthopedic residency, and did a uh, year hand fellowship at Brigham Women's Hospital in Boston, one of the Harvard-affiliated programs. Uh, following that, I came back to New Jersey. I was uh, born and raised in Livingston and decided to come back uh, with my wife at that time. And uh, we started to practice and had a new baby and bought a house all within a month. Uh, I specialize in hand and upper extremity surgery, uh, taking care of everything from the shoulder down to the fingertips. Um, I got into the field because uh, of my engineering background. Orthopedics was very attractive to me from a, a logical standpoint. Uh, in addition, it's very interesting because you see a wide variety of patients. I see patients from newborns to patients who are over 100 years old. Uh, in my free time, I spend a lot of time with my family, especially my children, um, and uh, I like to play golf, I run, and uh, my daughter, who is big into softball, I like to go to a lot of her games as well. Uh, why I work, like working in CV the most is because we're really a family. Um, there is a culture here that uh, really makes sure that the patients do come first, that they're treated with respect, uh, and that uh, they are cared for. Uh, the culture at Seaview is really one that um, we're well aware that the people coming into our office are at times injured or scared or um, in some way impaired. And we try to make them feel as comfortable as possible to try to get them better as quickly as possible as well. There's nothing better than having somebody come in saying they're waking up at night, every night with their hand being numb. Uh, you do a minor procedure, such as a carpal tunnel release on them, and then they can sleep through the night and they're quite grateful.